is God. Get ready to revisit your worst dreams and darkest fears as we take you on a spine-chilling journey through time. In 1984, the world was introduced to the horrifying realm of Freddy Krueger in A Nightmare on Elm Street. Now, fast forward to 2023, where we unveil the captivating transformation of the cast. Witness how the iconic characters have evolved, how their talents have sharpened, and how they continue to haunt our nightmares even decades later. Buckle up, for the nightmares are about to become all too real once again. <laughs> Number 1. Heather Langenkamp, then. Heather was 20 years old when she played Nancy Thompson, the brave and resourceful heroine who tried to stop Freddy from killing her and her friends. She was the daughter of an alcoholic mother, Marge Thompson, and police sergeant, Donald Thompson. In the Nightmare series Mythos, Nancy was the first character to defeat Freddy Krueger in the dream world. Nancy's appearance is recognizable by the gray streak in her hair and her emblematic pajamas. Now. Heather is currently 58 years old and still active in the entertainment industry. She is primarily known for her work in horror films, in addition to her work on television sitcoms. Langenkamp has also appeared in the films The Butterfly Room, Star Trek Into Darkness, and My Little Pony, A New Generation. On television, she has appeared in Growing Pains, Just the Ten of Us, Perversions of Science, and The Midnight Club. She is married to David Leroy Anderson, a special effects artist, and they have two children together. Just move away from us, son. Real easy, like your ass depended on. Number 2. John Saxon Then, John Saxon was 48 years old when he played Lieutenant Thompson, who investigates the murders of Freddy's victims. He was one of the parents that burned Freddy Krueger to death. Donald cared greatly for his wife and daughter and remained close to them after their divorce. He shows great love and passion for his daughter and promises her that he will catch Freddy Krueger after Glenn's death in words of comfort, even though he doesn't believe that Freddy survived his physical death. Now, Saxon sadly passed away on July 25, 2020, aged 83, due to complications from pneumonia. He was known for his work in westerns and horror films, even playing police officers and detectives. He has appeared in films like Rock, Pretty Baby, and Portrait in Black. In his later years, Saxon continued to appear mostly in independent films and appeared in several television series. He was married and divorced three times. <laughs> Number 3. Robert Englund Then, Englund was 37 years old when he played the role of Freddy Krueger. He is a serial killer and the main antagonist of the A Nightmare on Elm Street film series. A family man on the surface, Krueger was actually the serial killer, known as the Springwood Slasher. He was a child murderer who was burned alive by the parents of his victims. He returned as a vengeful spirit who could invade the dreams of the children of Elm Street and kill them in their nightmares. Now, Robert Englund is currently 76 years old and is still active in the entertainment industry. He has continued to act in various horror and sci-fi movies and TV shows such as Fear Clinic, Night World, The Midnight Man, The Prince and the Surfer, Good Day for It, and Stranger Things. He also reprised his role as Freddy Krueger in several sequels and spin-offs, as well as in the crossover movie Freddy vs. Jason. Englund has been married to actress Nancy Booth since 1988. They have no children together. Number 4. Johnny Depp Then, Johnny Depp was only 21 years old when he made his film debut as Glenn Lance, Nancy's boyfriend and one of Freddy's first victims. He played a typical teenager who loved music, video games, and sleeping. His character is best remembered for his gruesome death scene, where he is sucked into the bed and spewed out as a fountain of blood. He is the deuterogonist of A Nightmare on Elm Street. Now, Johnny Depp is one of the most famous actors in the world, with a career spanning over three decades and more than 80 films. He has starred in blockbuster franchises like Pirates of the Caribbean, Alice in Wonderland, and Fantastic Beasts, as well as critically acclaimed roles in films like Edward Scissorhands, Sweeney Todd, and Finding Neverland. 
Depp has always been involved in several controversies, such as his legal battles with his ex-wife Amber Heard, who accused him of domestic abuse. He is currently 59 years old. Number 5. Ronnie Blakely Then Ronnie Blakely was 38 years old when she played Marge Thompson, Nancy's alcoholic mother who hid a dark secret about Freddie's past. Marge Thompson is introduced to the story as a vulnerable woman who tries at all costs to hide her past, reveling in alcohol to silence her insecurities. However, Marge becomes strong and very aggressive when it comes to saving the life of her daughter, her most precious being. Now, Blakely is currently 77 years old and still active in the entertainment industry. She is perhaps best known for her role as the fictional country superstar Barbara Jean in Nashville. She has been part of many projects like Three Dangerous Ladies, Cinematon, and Someone to Love. She also wrote, produced, and directed the 2012 film Of One Blood. Blakely was married to German filmmaker Wim Wenders from 1979 to 1981. She has one child, author Sarah Blakely Cartwright. Number 6. Amanda Weiss Then Amanda Weiss was 24 years old when she played the role of Tina Gray. She was one of the Elm Street children whose parents were involved in burning and killing Freddy Krueger because he killed 20 children. She was also the first victim of Freddy after he became the undead dream demon. She is a strong-willed young girl who is often afraid of Freddy, but doesn't let fear get the better of her. Now, Weiss is currently 62 years old and is a retired American actress. She has appeared in several films and TV shows, such as Strategic Command, The Id, Silverado, Dexter, and CSI Crime Scene Investigation. She also starred in the comedy film Better Off Dead as Beth Truss, the ex-girlfriend of John Cusack's character. She is also known for playing Woody's ex-girlfriend Beth in two episodes of Cheers in the mid-1980s. Number 7. Jesu Garcia Nick Corey Then, Jesu Garcia was 20 years old when he played Rod Lane, Tina's rebellious boyfriend, who was falsely accused of her murder. Rod also was the second victim of Freddy Krueger's first post-death killing spree. He tends to become a little aggressive at times, but is characterized by constantly making practical jokes like scaring girls or making fun of Glenn. Now, Jesu Garcia has appeared in over 80 films and TV shows, including Along Came Polly, The Lost City, Che, and Undocumented. He also co-founded a production company called Scott J.R. Productions with John Roger, a spiritual teacher and author. Garcia also acted in theater, including a production of Grease, and won a Drama Log Award for his performance in the play Short Eyes. Number 8. Charles Flesher Then. Charles Flesher was 34 years old when he played the role of Dr. King. He's a doctor at the Kaja Institute for the study of sleep disorders that treated Nancy Thompson when her mother began to worry about her lack of sleep and nightmares. He complies with the stereotype of a doctor who cares about his patients, who is patient with their questions, and who has a certain curiosity about the unknown. Now, Charles Flesher is currently 74 years old and still active in the entertainment industry. He has voiced several characters in animated films and video games, such as Who Framed Robber Rabbit, The Polar Express, and Rango. He also appeared in Zodiac, The Backlot Murders, and Gridlocked. Flesher has been married to Cheryl Stressman since 1977. Together, they have two daughters. Number 9. Lynn Shea then, Lin Shay was 40 years old when she played Nancy's teacher in Nightmare on Elm Street. She had a minor role in the film, but she made an impression with her stern and caring demeanor. She was also one of the few adults who believed Nancy's story about Freddy. Now, Lin Shay has come a long way from being a nameless teacher in one of her first horror roles. She is now regarded as a scream queen due to her roles in various horror productions. Shay's horror film roles include Alone in the Dark, 2001 Maniacs, and its sequel, 2001 Maniacs, Field of Screams, Ouija, and its prequel, Ouija, Origin of Evil, The Grudge, and The Insidious Universe. Shay has been married twice. She is currently 79 years old.